so happy? Because Daddy is going to be home. And? And he's come away um Bowser and Mario. Yeah. Yeah, but what did I just tell you? That I was going to the doctor's office. And? And Patty is going to be here. Stay here with you, huh? Stay here with me. I let him know that he, Daddy was going to watch them as I go. And he was like, thank you, Mommy. Huh? You silly boy. They get really excited when I'm going to leave and they stay with Daddy. Huh? Oh. Uh, oh. <gasps> oh. Uh, oh. <sighs> open it. It's open. It's open. It's open. It's open. Hey, buddy. Can you Hi, come out to play? Yeah. <laughs> How are you? Vera, where do you think you're yeah. going? You stay Hi, here. Vera. Come here. Oh, it's so windy. Hey it's guys, windy. just got home from work. Alright guys, I am so happy right now. I just left my doctor's appointment and um, and everything looks great like always. Um, and I canceled the induction. They said you can just go however long you want. Um, and I did say that if I reach 41 weeks, that's when I start wanting to get induced. But um, I, I didn't get a, a cervical check or anything. And it wasn't like a big fight. I just said, I just know that nothing is wrong with the baby. That's what you guys say. Nothing's wrong with me. I'm not preeclamptic. I'm not... I don't have gestational diabetes. There's no medical reason for me to be induced early. And so we just canceled the appointment for the induction and we're good. So we gotta make my body do its thing. We gotta let my body do its thing. And it's what I've always wanted and I hope that I do go on my own and that I don't have to get induced at like 41 weeks. So, um, yeah, it just makes me so happy that I'm getting what I want. Because last time I just felt so frustrated. They were like, yep, we like to induce at 39 weeks, so this day works. Does it work for you? And I'm just like, whoa, 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 whoa. And so, you know, I've had a long time to think about it, like a week and a few days. And so I came back and everything's good. Everything's good. Okay, now I have to go home and tell Cameron. Oh, hi. Did you have a good nap? Here, let me take this off. Oh, I just love you so much. Mama had a nap too. You okay? I didn't have... So it's like we have the same schedule every week because it's Tuesday and we're at the park again and we're having a picnic, so, which is what we did last last week. It's so cold! Yes, it's windy and so that's what makes it even colder. Uh, she lost her shoe again. Let's go, Derek! <laughs> Here, Vera wants to do it too. Oh, you want to do it too, Vera? <laughs> no, that's not how you climb up, buddy. <laughs> Oops. Her shoe's falling off again. It is too dang cold. Maybe because we've gotten so used to the heat, you know, so this is cold to us. It's like 62. <laughs> I know, Aaron, it's, you're like, really? 62? <laughs> it's cooler than that. 
cooler than that? I don't think so. Because I'm cold. <laughs> but I don't have a sweater. I feel like Vera needs more layers on. She needs a beanie. Alright, here we are back at home where it's warm. We decided to have hot chocolates. Yumsies. Wait, listen. You hear that? Some more hot chocolate? Here, here. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> you like it too, bud? Yeah. I love hot chocolate. <laughs> she goes like <laughs> I know. <laughs> Something that I've tried um, over the past maybe four days for yeah like four or five days and I was gonna tell you guys when I was starting but I figured well let's see how it goes but I have my phone and I have my iPod uh, iTouch and um, I think I was starting to use it a little too much use devices too much and I have my laptop but I only use that to make the videos and to print out coupons so that's no big deal but um i found that it was taking a lot of my time because there's certain things i like to do on there candy crush is one of them watching other vlogs or something else that i like to do it's like my tv um and i decided to kind of you know put them aside and make more time for my kids and my family and it's been a good experience I think I've done pretty good and you know I didn't use it too much my house was you know I always try and keep it clean so that means you know I'm not using my my phone while I'm cleaning and I would you know I do school with Derek four days a week here and you know, can and just I try and give them attention. Away? Yes, you can. Yes, throw it away. Thank you. So anyway, it's been a good, I think it's since Friday, so five days. It's been a good five days where I've kept those aside and I've paid more attention to my kids and to the house. And, the and I've had more time to just relax myself, like just lay down watch something with Derek or whatever. So anyway, I um, challenge you if you are someone like me who was using your, who's using your devices a lot to put them aside and talk to your family members and stuff. So just saying a little thing I tried. such a nice feeling when the kids are tucked in their beds and just knowing that we get to rest because they're resting. Oh honey. Yes. Oh he took a nap. <laughs> but I did too today so that's all. That was okay. While Derek was playing with his little track on the ground. That little track from the last vlog, he was playing with it while I was sleeping. Yes. When moms take a nap, they don't really nap. We just kind of like, okay, he's okay, you know? Derek was playing with the Tajimono. Yeah. Yeah. So I didn't get much like action footage this time. Um, just yet. because, yet, <laughs> just because I'm so tired all the time. I mean, there was a bunch of toys on the ground just now, and I wasn't going to touch them because that's just too hard for me. So Is Dad, it did it for me. Oh, okay. <laughs> now we got some action. But um, I'm, I'm feeling a lot of contractions. I mean, not a lot because they're not regular. They're not coming in waves like true labor, but I, it's... Yeah, so I'm sure it's just false labor. My body is just preparing for this baby to come. So anyway, I've just been kind of blah, and that's what I mean by, like, that's why I'm not getting 
a lot of footage. I just kind of, you know, let the kids go outside or, um, which I've gone out there with them for a little bit too. To you guys, I'm, I'm just saying this is not saying anything bad about you. Yeah. To you guys, it may seem like Vivian talks a lot about pregnancy things or whatever, but this is what we're waiting for. It's like, come on. Well, you know, and I'm sure like, I'm sure they're watching too, and they're kind of like anticipating yeah. labor to come too. Yeah, you have to stay tuned. But it's like it's like waiting to get bombed. Have I already said that? Maybe. I don't know. It's like waiting for a bomb to go off. <laughs> and it takes forever, and you're like, oh, it's a dud. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it just it's what we're about right now. We're just waiting. I'm waiting like at work for a call to say, Hey, it's time and I have to rush home or something. Yeah, I don't know. Hopefully it's not boring the during this time. After it's gonna be crazy. So excitement is coming. <laughs> And I don't even know then if I'll be able to vlog because I'll be so busy nursing the baby and whatever. Oh, you have to. They're waiting for that. <laughs> but anyway, maybe they're even like wondering what's going on with the pregnancy. They're watching and they see me this pregnant and then I don't say anything. So I have to update you guys even though tomorrow I probably will do my pregnancy update. But... Alright, I gotta lay down. We'll see you guys on the next vlog. And when will you see this? Friday? No, you'll see this tomorrow. I just messed up. <laughs> she's been forgetting a lot. I got home today and she's like, Yeah, I went to the store. I didn't get sto soda. And then she opens the fridge, there's soda sitting there, and I'm like, you just <laughs> said you didn't get soda. And then what else was it? I went to Walmart the other day and I forgot my wallet, and it was pretty bad. I was about to cry, and I'm just forgetting lots of things, so. Yeah. I'm really, really big. So this is what's making me so tired, so big, and so... Every night, I have to put on some lotion. Something's wrong with this. Does it look bad? It's yellow. It's just the lighting in here. It shouldn't be that. It's like starting to turn purple because of how stretched it is. Oh no. Does it look purple to you? That's not how my regular skin looks. I don't know. But anyway, I'm glad I haven't gotten new stretch marks. With Derek, I got some that were going like this, like this, and you can still see them, of course. And with Vera, I got one right here. And so that's the most noticeable one. But I'm just so tired of carrying this. I, I wish Cameron could, I could be like, here, you carry it now. <laughs> to finish it off? Yeah. Just for the last two weeks, that's it. That's all I'm asking. <laughs> and then you can give it back and I'll push the baby out. <laughs> but I have to put lotion on before bed. And so... And my shirts barely fit now. I have to... When I wear them, I have to keep pulling them. And yes, I'm wearing these because nothing else fits. So... I hope you can hear me. I feel so far away from it. I usually have you like right here. <laughs>